Kajinya langkah kenhun menteri ke sorgar MDA tu kalau si mnya karai berkentil dorya ke umpan yang diesel dasan pau pisa ni si pia silitar. U menteri yang bak ke jelah megalia ulu ong bak ke don kajinya pair ke dor diesel ha asam bat megalia halo ke umpan yang diesel kumta lah si mnya karai berkentil no si pia. Ulu ong bana ke jengkil dor ke sorgar ke nyok lum kajina san hadu nriu kelur tingkah haka si senam. Second decision that was taken uh, was regarding the uh, increase uh, in terms of the rate of tax on diesel. Uh, the, as you are aware that, uh, that uh, the price uh, of diesel between uh, Meghalaya and Assam as of now is quite high. Uh, uh, Guwahati the rate is 90 rupees 33 paisa. Whereas in Kanapara it is 84 rupees 10 paisa. That means a difference of 6 rupees 23 paisa in diesel is there right now between Kanapara and Guwahati. And hence, uh, obviously, looking at the overall revenue for the state, uh, we have decided to increase it in a first stage uh, by 50 paisa. And uh, so, as I said, we will uh, keep two things in mind. Number one, that there should be a uh, uh, kind of a difference in the rate so that we have a rate advantage between Guwahati market and the Revoy and Kanapara, Kanapara market. Uh, and number two, that we will always keep in mind the national average so that the overall rates do not go uh, above the national average. And we have been always maintaining that Meghalaya is as of now maintaining one of the lowest rates uh, of petrol uh, price and diesel price in the country as of now. The point is that, as I said, number one, uh, every decision will affect something or the other. There's nothing, uh, nothing to hide about that. Uh, but the point is, if you look at the difference in the price, it's at six rupees right now, and hence uh, more than six rupees, in fact. So that's very high. Normally, we have maintained a difference of about two to three rupees, and hence there is clearly a huge scope of revenue uh, for us. Uh, we are increasing it by fifty pesa right now, and we'll see accordingly uh, as we go along uh, how we can. Uh, further reduce the gap because as I said a gap of 5-6 rupees is very high. It's never happened before. Uh, but yes, uh, impact will be there marginally. Uh, I'm not saying there's going to be a huge impact or uh, anything in the prices. It's not that uh, we'll see complete uh, escalation of prices. But as I said, uh, we have to balance as a government both sides. We have to also see revenue. We need revenue generation. So therefore, uh, this is a clearly a, an area of revenue generation for us and uh, there's a reason. Seeing that huge gap, we have decided to take this step. So therefore, the, the rates are, if you look at it, in the whole, I just give you an example of Kanapara because that's what matters. But if you look at the rate in Shillong, it's 85.72. So Kanapara is 84.1. Uh, Tura is 85.5. Ampati is 85.57. And these are differences there because of the transportation cost. Uh, and the Guwahati is 90.3. So even in a place like from say Tura or Shillong or Ampati, there's a difference of 5 rupees. With this height, how much we are collecting, putting in the state's buffer? Uh, we expect maybe a, in an annual basis, we'll uh, have an impact of close to about 5. So yeah. Only for 50 pesos, yeah. 5-6 crores. Yeah, 5-6 yeah. crores is what we expect in a, of increase in the revenue uh, annually.